Hey guys, this is the Spirit Ronger 187 and welcome back and we are playing another match of Hearthstone. Well, I just have this game for like 4 or 5 days now and it's really been off the charge. I can tell you if you like Shadow Era, you're going to love this game. Really every match against the opponents online or against the AI have been very very different and uh, sometimes I win with a very big ally or just lots of lots of allies and uh, yeah every game is such so different it's, it's really yeah it's a real nice game especially the uh, the other mode that you have the the mode that looks like meltdown it's pretty cool I'll show you in the maybe at the end of this uh, this movie or in the next video okay what we are playing here is a priest deck, it's got some healing powers and it's quite a nice deck to play. Uh, here we go playing this mana coin, giving me one more mana this turn. And we're going to cast out our uh, Raisin 4 Hunter to get some board control here. It drops another minion and we're going to end the turn. I also love really these effects here. You can click with your mouse, light the campfire, <laughs> pretty funny. Right click your uh, hero and you can uh, greet your opponent or do something. I'm playing against the mage now. Uh, he's going to destroy my allies, at least one of them. And this one is really a nice card. Whenever one of your minions is healed, healed draw a card. Especially with the ability. So nice to gain some extra cards. Um, so what we're going to drop now is, I think this one, because I'm a little bit scared to lose this one. So I want the, the ally with town to play, and we'll just end turn here. So yeah, you have the arena mode, which looks a lot like a Meltdown from Shadow Era, and a bit like Booster Drafting from Magic the Gathering. But I'll show you, I think, at the end of the video. Or maybe in the next video, I'm going to show you a match of the, the arena mode. So you're going to drop a big freeze any character damage by this minion. That's a very nice ally he has over there. Um, we really want to take that one out. Um, let's see. Here. Well, I think we're going to. Um, Cast this one over here. Give him some healing to draw another card. And we're going to give him two more health. So he has six health now. And draw another card. And our taunt ally stays uh, alive a bit longer. And the reason why I give him plus health is because he is taking all the hits at the moment. Because he has to attack him. So this is really a really very nice card. I don't know if it's a common, uncommon or rare or something, but I still have to look uh, into that a bit. Now uh, there it goes, that sucks, he's going to take it out now. But that card really saved the game so many times. I only played like 5 or 6 times online. Uh, I played some more matches offline to unlock some new cards. Uh, so here it says he's got 5 defense left. And that's a lot. So we are going to take it down. Destroy ally with 3 or less attack. And we are going to drop down our charger. Which is not very good against this opponent because he can kill it with an easy ability. So you can also poke out the eye. <laughs> this uh, little thing here. So he's going to draw some cards here. Got three mana left. Let's see what he's going to do. He's going to freeze all of my minions so they can't attack next turn. And what do we have here? This is not very, very good. So I think we're just going to heal ourselves up. Or not. Yeah, let's just play this one here, heal ourselves up some more. That's the only thing we can do now, so it's a little bit boring, boring turn, a, a bit of a waste of a turn, but 
because I only have high cards in my hand. This one is really nice, mind control. Take control of an enemy minion, I can destroy a minion. I have a pretty big ally here in my hand that I can play next to him. Which we are we going to do, because we have some allies on the board. Uh, a 7-7 seven, seven war golem. And double a minion's health, which is really nice with this one. Okay, so we are going to cause the Gulam, I think. And, um, do we want to take this one out? We can do that. We create those taunt allies. Let's hit him in the face and destroy him, sacrificing one of my allies and <laughs> reducing him to one that sucks, but. We still have some uh, control cards in our hand left for this turn if we play something scary. But he has a lot of cards in his hand. Guilty damage and freeze it. Okay, so we have to heal him next turn. That's what we are going to do. We're going to heal him if he survives. Yep, that card deals 3 damage to random targets. And it only hit me. So that's a good thing. So this is uh, going to deal 2 damage to all enemies and restore my health of my allies. So that's nice as well. So let's heal him up. And that's it I guess. This one is not really scary. We'll just keep out those cards in our hands. Because this one I could kill his ally but it's just a 1-2 with no ability or something left, so we'll just keep it an eye on. Summons an... what is it? Summons an, uh, an awesome intervention, wow, what's that? At the end of the turn, restore 6 health to... to what? To a damaged character. How nice is that? Um... Well, I do think I want to keep this one. I want to steal or not. Do we have something better? No. We do want to steal this one here. And we can't attack, so that's it for this turn. We'll just unturn here. So let's hope he's not going to play something really scary here with this 10 mana. You have some real awesome cards that you can play for 10 mana. Okay, he's going to do me some damage. It doesn't matter. And he's going to attack my allies. But we have pretty much the board here. Let's see how we are going to play this. Um, no, we're not going to. We're going to destroy this one and this one. And we're going to play the stunt ally for sure. We are going to uh, play this one to heal my ally. He's going to restore, but that doesn't really matter. We are going to restore him, I think. Now we're going to restore this one. Give him some more health back. And end turn. So we have pretty much the board control here, and we have five cards in our hands. We can destroy an ally, we can deal some damage, double a minion's health. So we're pretty comfortable here. There comes his last card. Okay, we have to clear the board a bit now. Next turn. Oh, this is a really nice card. Destroy a minion with 5 attack or more. This is really nice in late game. So we're going to shock him. I just want to kill it all off. This is taunt. This is taunt as well. Let's just kill them all. I don't care. And finish off that one. 
Uh, this one belongs to him. This one belongs to him. And we have both control. Okay, they've all attacked, right? Then we play this one, giving an extra strength for all of these. So here we have complete control. He, he has the top deck, and I think he's going down. So this deck is really, really nice, this priest deck. Uh, I'm still playing some other decks offline, uh, trying to unlock some more cards. Because if you, you can like unlock 10 or 20 cards for each deck, and to receive booster packs and gold when you win an online match. Let's give him some more health. Draw a card. Play this Ghulam here. And smack him for a lot. And I will just keep this into play. Let's double the life of this War Ghulam here. And I turn. So I think he's dead. I do not know if there's any card that can save him. And I have 11 cards in my deck left. He does have the same. And we have one. So my second uh, upload, I think, or my third upload <laughs> to YouTube is a win. So that's really nice. And I really like this priest deck. But. Uh, so let's go uh, back and take a little look at the arena. So at the arena you're opening some random cards and you get to choose out of three cards and you pick one and then you get to see three cards again and you can pick some uh, one of them as well until you have like 30 cards in your deck and then you're going to play. But what's really interesting is that uh, if you keep winning you keep this deck. So. Uh, it's like a little bit for the guys who play Shadow Era and Meltdown, you play one match and your deck is gone. Uh, in this concept, uh, you have to lose three times and then your deck is gone or until you retire, I think. I haven't tried it out, but I think. Um, and then you're going to drop the deck and start all over again with a new deck. And I think it will cost like 100 gold, so... And really nice if you keep winning and yeah, this this deck I won pretty nice, uh, pretty easily the, the last match. So uh, yeah, in my next video I will play uh, a arena mode match and yeah, that's really even more fun than the normal game. So yeah, I hope you like this match. Do not forget to like, comment, subscribe and in the description below you can find some uh, uh, a link to the Hearthstone uh, website from Blizzard and there you can find the latest content and information about the game. So, see you next match. Cheers!